The COVID-19 pandemic has generated tremendous interest in vaccine development. Governments, philanthropic organizations, and drug companies collectively have devoted billions of dollars toward finding a vaccine. Until one or more candidates actually hit the market, those expenses will only grow. That sounds like a lot of money, but how much does developing a vaccine typically cost? That's a difficult question to answer. The precursors of full-fledged vaccines are known as vaccine candidates. They usually build off technologies, molecules, or biological materials that are often already in a pharmaceutical company's research and development pipeline. That means the company made some of its investment before it even knew it was developing a particular vaccine. Another complicating factor? Pharmaceutical companies rarely say how much they spend on a given drug. But to provide some context, the 10 companies with the biggest R&D budgets spent a total of $82 billion in 2019 looking for and developing potential vaccines and treatments. Some of that money funds preclinical exploration of potential drugs' capabilities, including whether they might work in humans. The vaccine candidates that look most promising become candidates for phase one, two, and three trials. These studies examine how well the vaccines work, whether they can be administered safely, and what the most effective dose would be, among many other things. Researchers estimate that it costs between $31 million and $68 million on average to move a single vaccine candidate through these stages. Historically, it typically takes a candidate more than a decade to move through all clinical trials, and only 6% of vaccine candidates actually make it to market. Testing failed candidates can build knowledge that helps produce the successful ones, but it also adds to the cost of vaccine development. After accounting for all those false starts and blind alleys, it may cost between $319 and $469 million to bring a single vaccine candidate to market, and those are averages. The researchers who created that estimate found that the total cost could run up to $1.1 billion. Once a vaccine is ready for market, it costs money to produce commercial volumes of it. What's more, the COVID-19 pandemic has upended the traditional drug development process, and now health officials and drug makers are moving forward with manufacturing plans even before the vaccine candidates prove their safety or efficacy. All in, from early research through commercial availability, industry experts estimate that the cost of developing a new vaccine could range from $400 million to $2 billion. In the case of COVID-19, at least 40 vaccines are already somewhere in the development process, not including the Sputnik V vaccine, which was approved by the Russian Ministry of Health August 11th. The companies developing those vaccines are incurring all sorts of costs, from the lab resources used in running experiments to the multiple clinical trials necessary to establish each candidate's safety and effectiveness. If researchers' averages are right, these drugs will likely cost hundreds of millions, if not billions, to develop. That said, the coronavirus pandemic could potentially cost the world's economy more than $80 trillion. So compared to the magnitude of the economic threat that COVID-19 poses, the cost of developing a vaccine might end up looking quite reasonable.